It's so pretty. I love this fountain here at the Greenway where we're walking today for the 9-11 virtual 5K. We signed up for it online. It's really gorgeous. I love that fountain over there. It's a beautiful area to live. We saw some apartments over there where we had to park at and um, it was real nice, the apartment complex, but I'm not sure how much it is per month. I have to look into all that. And then I'd have to talk my mom into selling her house because we're helping her with her um, bills and everything right now. And with life overall, helping her, taking her places that she needs to go. So she won't have to rely on public transportation and all that, so she would need to come with us. That would be awesome if we could move there, though. So beautiful. You like this area, Ashlyn? Beautiful, huh? <laughs> Yay. Then we could put our little kayak or pedal boat, whatever we decide to put in the water, and have some fun. Our lifeboat never came from Wish, but we should have never ordered it anyway because that's a Chinese company. I didn't realize that when I ordered it. But we did get our pool from them, at least. All right. Thank God for our soldiers and our first responders who responded to 9-11. Keeping all of them in prayers, especially now, and all the coronavirus victims in prayers that they will heal and that the vaccine will be finished soon, which they're talking about right now. So they won't have to do a second stimulus check, and so they can save people's lives. Here's hoping. So gorgeous out here today. And a little panoramic view, even though I'm not really doing it with my phone. Even though my phone will do that. But I'm thankful we can do this, though. I'll show you my patriotic scarf I wore. Let me turn it around. See? I wore it as a ponytail. <laughs> because I have a tiny, short ponytail, and I wanted to have one. I was thankful I could serve in the Army, and thankful that I made it home safely and all so did my comrades so I still try to keep up with some of them today and help them out if they need help <laughs> hopefully they can um, we can all visit each other again soon and spend time together and next year maybe we can go in one of these 5k's um, that's not virtual and we can do it with a bigger crowd that'd be awesome we also have a Mary Kay um, Domestic Violence Cancer Awareness uh, 5K, virtual 5K coming up on October 3rd and a uh, Alzheimer Awareness um, 5K coming up on October 17th. So we're going to try to do both of those. Great worthy causes. Great way to do it. Love you. Peace. God bless the USA and the world. Amen.